Okay, you guys have somebody in your guys' energy trying to cloak themselves or um, disguise themselves or something of like that. <laughs> Speaking of, wow. I don't know how this card got in there. Gemini, Crossroads, 22. That's interesting. Wow. Okay, 8th house. Okay, so yeah, somebody's trying to... Um, wow. Somebody's trying to cloak themselves or something or hide. Interesting. I did not know that card was in there. That's so interesting that came out. Okay. Show me this energy spirit. I'm picking up something with a friend. Um, this could be a Sagittarius. They know that somebody's getting ready to travel or something like that or depart or move on. This is the end of a cycle. This, Whatever this is, the cycle is completely done, over with. What is this? They're playing, yeah, the moon. They're playing in y'all's energy. They're doing this um, in secret, behind the scenes or in the dark. They're trying to cast their feelings onto you guys or something with, um, this person is broken hearted and sad and they're trying to project that off onto you guys or something of that nature. But they're trying to play in someone's energy. Like they're trying to disguise themselves. They're trying to make you think like that's not them. A lot of you guys already know exactly who this is. Yeah, I'm sensing somebody like in another room. They're like projecting their energy off onto somebody. They could know you're at a crossroads, Gemini. Yeah, that's this card that was stuck in between there. They could be trying to keep you guys at a crossroads. I swear that card was not in there when I started. But um, Gemini, embrace the flow of life. Full moon in Gemini. You got another option or another choice or something. You could be going towards a soulmate, a twin flame, or um, this is your person getting ready to leave or something like that. And um, possibly there's going to be some kind of reconciliation I'm sensing here. This person is super broken hearted. If you guys start to feel um, some kind of negativity or some kind of physical sensations in your heart center um, or your chest area, that's somebody else projecting that off onto you guys for most of y'all. Okay, yeah, your twin flame is like, your twin flame is like, they need help. They're communicating energetically. Whoever this karmic person is or people doing this, I feel like this is somebody that, um, for a lot of y'all, somebody's staying with. Your twin flame is communicating like they need help, something's wrong with them. They're looking at this energy like they're evil and stuff. They can sense this. Your twin flame can sense this. Oh, well, uh, just looking at that, um, embrace the flow. And then here's the flow again, go with the flow, embracing the flow. You guys are embr embracing the flow. Somebody wants you guys to have a lack of courage and wants you guys to be powerless, not have any strength. This could be something about family. Letting go. Yeah. Whoever's doing this, they know they're being let go of. You guys could be doing a lot of cleansing healing or being open to receiving there's a new cycle is getting ready to happen 
spring is um, right around the corner. I just heard they're not talking. Somebody in someone's environment, your twin flame is not talking to them really. They're real distant. I just heard something about violence. There could be something about some kind of violence. Why are they trying to send this energy off to somebody? I feel like they're trying to send this off onto um, the twin flames with this Gemini energy, this lover's energy. I feel like they could, um, somebody could be playing um, really loud music or something like that. Um, yeah, somebody's like, turn that down. They're trying to create imbalances or something. Why are they trying to do this, Spirit? Because they have a consciousness of lack. They're in like the Five of Pentacles energy. I feel like they know they're getting ready to be abandoned. They could have abandonment issues. Whoever this is doesn't want to do the inner work or inner healing. Um, I feel like they know they're getting ready to be left or something like that. inspiration you guys could be feeling inspired or inspiring somebody be prepared something is going to happen you were you will you will soon receive a visit some of you guys be prepared somebody's going to be calling you they may call you or message you at any time somebody's about to leave you may be hearing from your twin flame just out the blue like hey babe i i gotta go <laughs> that's what I'm sensing here they're trying to find a way to um, like sacrifice you guys they're trying to find a way to sacrifice y'all before it's too late or something 14, Red Riding Hood, Rites of Passage. Yeah, they know this person's getting ready to leave and go on their right path. They could be um, taboos. 17, Blue Beard. You see the skull there? There's going to be um, an ending. Some of you guys, they may be trying to um, cast their illness onto you guys. Whatever that heart issues energy is, I'm sensing, they may be trying to cast that onto you guys and trying to get you sick and trying to kill you or something. Trying to get you to manifest um, some kind of illness. It's not going to happen, um, but that's what they're trying to do. Looks like they've been doing this for a little while. That's what I've been seeing out in these readings. They could be worried about, um, for some of y'all, they could be worried about holding on to somebody for some money. They could be worried that they're going to be in this consciousness of lack or poverty after somebody moves on or leaves. Yeah, a lot of you guys with this moon feelings, a lot of you guys are sensing this. You guys are sensing, um, yeah, y'all been doing a lot of healing. Y'all are sensing this change. There's a change. They could be um, music. Yes, yeah, see, is what I was saying. Music. I'm seeing somebody like in another room playing super loud music. Someone's like, turn that shit down. Even in this reading, they're trying to um, cloak or disguise their energy. They don't want um, this karmic energy. They don't want you guys to know like this is them. I can see right through this. This is a karmic energy though. A lot of you guys see right through too. You guys are um, 
involved in some kind of spiritual partnership or some kind of divine connection. Nothing to fear, all is well. Um, just return it to sender. Do what you guys need to do to protect your guys' selves. You guys could also, if you guys are involved in a high vibrational soul connection, you could also call on your twin flame if you guys are separated or at a distance to protect you spiritually. Especially like if it's a divine masculine, you can call on your divine masculine. This is going to be returned to sender anyways, this energy. I'm picking up something about, um, yeah, they don't have a spiritual connection. This is a karmic. There's going to be a happy ending. Just wait. I'm hearing something about John. They want to come in between that, your spiritual connection, your spiritual partnership, but they're not going to be able to. This change is still going to come. They may be trying to... Um, Okay, let's just dive into this. Okay, Archangel Michael, what is this? Somebody trying to cloak themselves or something like that and cast some kind of energy off onto someone else, a karmic partner. Yeah. Somebody in the environment, I feel like for a lot of you guys, this could be a Gemini. Moon and Gemini, they're doing this um, behind the scenes. I feel like they're playing in both of y'all's energies. They're going to regret this. Saturn and Capricorn, 10th house. Riches. Adaptability. This could be a change in somebody's um, career, their status, some success. You could be more abundant now. So whoever this is is very pissed off, frustrated. Like you have another option, or you have you found a way out. Um, a lot of the twin flames, especially the divine masculines, are getting ready to depart situations and go. Um, possibly reconcile or um, have met divine feminines who are more abundant, who have more of a um, wealthy mindset, who have money, who have security. That's looking a lot more attractive than this consciousness of luck energy with whoever that is. Okay, what else? They're trying to um, cast their energy. Mm-hmm. This could be a cancer. Um, sun in fourth house. I feel like this is in the home or in the environment for a lot of y'all. I feel like they're doing this inside of a house. If somebody doesn't want... This energy is very low vibrational, so I'm going to warn you guys ahead of time. If I start cussing and stuff, excuse me. But um, Okay, moon in Gemini. I'm picking up on a friend, too. There's a friend in the environment. Somebody could be staying with a friend or something like that. They don't want you guys to persevere. They don't want you to have the courage, strength to persevere with something with this change. Okay, spirits, let me know. They're trying to cloud your judgment. Saturn and Capricorn. Discovery. This could also be something about parents also. Okay, I'm picking up on a masculine energy that's discovered something. Your divine masculine has discovered something. 
This could be something about some communication, text messages, emails, calls, letters. And sun and fourth house. Resourcefulness, enlightenment. Somebody in this energy wants you guys to think like um, something with spirituality, like, like oh, it's fake, and it's not real. That's what somebody's thinking with in this energy. They want you to think like, oh, Twin Flames is not real. Okay, show me this moon in um, Gemini Perseverance. Reversed. This person is very sad and heartbroken. They're watching you guys a lot. Somebody's like stalking somebody. They're living together and stalking this person. Possibly in the next room or something like that. They could know that you're getting ready to have some kind of stability elsewhere. Or build with somebody else elsewhere. Or possibly go to another workplace elsewhere. Unexpected joy. This could be some unexpected gifts also or money, stability. Somebody's twin flame feels like they've won the jackpot or something or got lucky. It's a lucky time. What else? They're playing in somebody's energy. Okay, somebody realizes this is an enemy. They realize they're staying with an enemy. This could be a frenemy too, or some kind of foe energy. Spirit says they're sending you the evil eye or something like that. Evil eye. Do what you guys need to do to protect yourself. It's very, very important. It's like they're literally watching them, possibly watching them on some readings in the other room. <laughs> sad. Yeah, they're stressed. They're stressed and they're sad crying. They could be trying to send this energy to you guys. Hoping like you guys are supposed to be sad or emotional. There could be some kind of confession also. See, they're stressed. Show me this enemy. Yeah, their mask fell off. They forgot to put their mask on. Somebody uncovered some kind of deception with some enemy. They've been inconsistent. Yeah, someone's one flame is like, they're fake. Whoever this is, is trying to make your twin flame think like you're fake or something. Their frustration. Frustration. Okay, so they're watching them in another room or something. Daughter of Knife's Reverse. Yeah. They're stalking them in another bedroom or the other room or something like that. The moon. And then, yeah. The moon. Judgment. Yeah, they know it's over. So this is why they're doing this stuff. The sun. Yeah. You guys already see this, though. You already consensus or feel this. Uh, this could be a Pisces, Cancer, Leo, Scorpio. Judgment. They're going through. They're going to get. Um, they're just racking up karmic debt. 
basically with this death reversed Scorpio like I said they could be um, trying to because I keep seeing like somebody's trying to cast off some kind of um, heart issues or something like that off onto somebody their heartbreak their pain their sorrow they want you guys to um, think that's yours it's like they're trying to blur the lines they want you to think that's yours and then they want you to manifest like your own illness and like you get sick and then possibly attract your own death they're doing any little thing to try to figure out how to get rid of you it's not gonna work though um, yeah this is over if you're doing this you're just wasting your time yet again Show me this energy, their stress. I keep sensing teary energy with this. They could be stressed over money or finances. They're doing dark magic. Knight of Chalices. You guys look like you guys are both sensing this already. They're all in y'all's energy two coins reversed I feel like they're trying to create um, blockages they're trying to make sure this person doesn't take steps forward to literally move or move on or move out mm -hmm. they're in this nine of swords trying to cast this onto you guys looks like they've been doing this at least the last couple weeks Lots of anxiety, night terrors, could be having nightmares. That's them. Don't get it fucked up. That's them. Uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. A lot of water energy here. See with this judgment coming out sideways in the moon. They they're trying to <laughs> this is them trying to um they're trying to hide. Apology. Show me this energy. Somebody could be getting ready to apologize to you. Yeah, they're in this devil energy. See your person. Just take off the D. Off the devil. This person sees they're evil. This is some low vibrational ass energy. Yeah, they're in despair. Your person, y'all are remaining hopeful. You guys are going to get what you want. Somebody's inspiring you or you're inspiring your person, possibly spiritually. Um, you guys could be a light worker. Someone's in despair because you remain hopeful. They're in this devil energy. They could be doing a lot of addictive uh, things, smoking, drinking, low vibrational stuff. There's a lot of hope for you guys. Expect an apology. Show me this enemy. Yeah, I keep hearing something about John or something for some of you guys. Enemy. Their mask fell off. And this is what they're seeing. The devil. The Hierophant. God is, I feel like this is God has shown you guys. This is being shown for a reason. Why are they frustrated? They're just stalking somebody in the other room or something. That's weird. That's weirdo stuff. Five of chalices reverse. They're frustrated because they know you're moving on. This is over. This is the end. You guys could be getting ready to step into your purpose. I see a divine masculine getting ready to step, step into his purpose. Um, this could be a divine masculine. I see a lot of divine masculines that are getting ready to um, start their own channels, start their own um, tarot channels and stuff like that. Could be something about some kind of religion also. Could be a Taurus. Show me this person stalking them. Death reverse. Daughter knife's reverse. Knave of pentacles reverse. They're trying to um, do dark magic over you guys, especially the empress energies. I'm seeing somebody that's trying to... Um, I'm seeing a man that's trying to... They're trying to kill a, a feminine energy, possibly a woman, maybe a pregnant woman and a child. They're trying to create a death for somebody. 
it's not going to happen that way. If this is for you, Divine Masculine, they may be trying to, um, they may be trying to create a death for a feminine energy in your life or a mother, a baby mama, or your kids. Five of Wands reverse, yeah. They need to watch out because, um, it's not going to happen that way. It's going to, it's going to re be returned to them. Six of Cups. Yes, Spirit's saying he's trying to kill the pregnant woman. Some woman in this energy is pregnant for some of y'all. What is this unexpected joy? Something unexpected is here, possibly with some kind of um, money, status, success, unexpected income. I feel like somebody's twin flame already has some kind of plans or arrangements or they got a place to stay with their twin flame or something like that. They got another destination. Unexpected joy. The tower. Ace of Wands. Yeah, there's going to be something new. They're about to be hella hurt once they realize this shit did not work. Yet again. Some kind of initiation. Ace of Wands. Yeah, I keep hearing they're not talking. They're not talking in a house or an environment. This is what's making them do this. They could be trying to stop a reunion. Reunion reverse. Cheerfulness reverse. This is the enemy. They're just stalking and spying on you guys or something in someone's house. They're going to be dealing with a lot of misfortune. They're in despair, lack of hope. Somebody's friends or something. This could be some roommates and stuff. Pleasure seekers. They know there's a change. High priestess reverse. Yeah. Money reverse. They could be losing money. Um, I just strongly keep sensing like I'm seeing somebody getting ready to move. They're trying to kill somebody's wife and a child. I keep seeing that. You guys are protected. Don't worry. Trying to stop a reunion. Yes, they are the sun. You guys already see this though. Some man, it's, it's some man in this energy too is real pissed off. Knight of Chalice is reversed. This person's super heartbroken. This could be a karmic femme too. There's some man in this energy acting like a straight up bitch. He's, he's in some kind of feminine energy. The world. Yeah, it's still going to be over. They're not stopping anything. It's just making this person want to leave. That's all it's doing. Yeah. Your person or whoever this is in the environment, they could both be watching tarot videos and stuff behind closed doors. I'm just seeing two people in like two separate rooms or two different areas in the house. Show me they're not talking or something. Because it's done, the world. It's all awkward and shit. Yeah, there's a there's there this is their heartbreak and pain that they're trying to cast onto you guys. They're trying to come in between two people because they know their connection is over or a friendship is over. Spirit return this to sender. Don't worry. Yeah, they're trying to set you guys up or something. They're just stalking. Yeah, don't worry. This is gonna this is gonna balance out. Don't even worry. Show me this cheerfulness reversed.
there is something new coming for you guys a new manifestation Empress Reverse they're feeling very insecure very jealous they could be jealous of a new opportunity for you or some kind of growth or excuse me or some new money or something like that Somebody wants you in bad health for some reason. It's not going to work like that. If you're doing this, it's going to be unsuccessful. Your mask already came off. Somebody already sees this person for who they are. They're seeing they're, they're in this devil energy. Y'all are putting your own lives at risk doing this. Yeah, enemy. This enemy already came out twice. Show me this discovery. Somebody could have found something out about some kind of money, some hidden money, secret money. Possibly through a letter or some kind of communication. Falseness reversed. Message. Yeah, this is an ill energy. They're trying to cast this onto you guys. This is them. Tell us more about this letter. Some kind of communication. This person says they're looking at somebody sideways. <laughs> they're looking at somebody sideways. Like they're looking at your twin sideways and stuff in the home or something. They're keeping a very close eye at it, but it's like becoming really weird. It's becoming real strange. Letter. Spring. So this is about to, something's about to happen. Your love is blooming. Karmic partner. The answer is no. And this karmic is going to be getting left out in the colds. They feel left out in the colds. If you're karmic doing this, you better stop what you're doing immediately. Letter. Karmic partner. If somebody don't want you, they don't want you. Let's see. It didn't work. You guys did something recently. It didn't work. You're trying to create blockages or delays or trying to stop somebody from moving forward or keep them at a stalemate or something like that. It's not going to work like that. I'm seeing a man also cock blocking too. Yeah, they're trying to have somebody in this five of coins lack mentality or some kind of bad health or something. Show me this five of coins. Emperor were reversed. This could be a karmic doing this or karmic masculine doing this. Is this the person trying to have somebody in bad health? Yeah, they're trying to create an ending or loss. They're trying to um they're trying to get somebody to pass. They could be putting something in somebody's cups or their drinks or something like that devil yeah this person's evil devil they're trying to keep something stuck this is this is 
they're doing this, um, hang demand reverse. They're trying to create delays or um, keep this person in limbo or something. They're trying to buy time. They're trying to kill off somebody. That's what they're trying to do. So they, just so they can hold on to this person, ain't gonna work that way. If you're doing this, you got another thing coming. See, Ace of Swords, you got another thing coming. The answer is no. Six of coins. They could have sent them a message or shared something in a letter. Four swords. Yeah, spirit says no. You're not going to be able to send no bad health or your illness or mental illness or nothing like that off onto nobody. That's that's your that's yours. Whoever you're trying to send this off to is their things are balancing out for them. They're they're balanced. Their mental health is good. Their health is good. That's your health is terrible. That's you drinking. That's you stressing. That's you got anxiety. That's you that can't control your emotions. Queen of Wands reverse. There's a lot of people doing this. Seven of Cups. Yeah, they're trying to play in your energy. Show me this falseness reverse. They're trying to um, somehow spiritually make somebody think like you guys are fake, you're false. They could be trying to start some kind of drama. Yeah, I see people doing all kind of stuff. Spell work, all kind of stuff. It ain't gonna work. No, I'm gonna keep repeating that too. Whoever's doing this, they figure like they keep just doing it over and over and over. Eventually it'll work or something. No. What is this illness energy, sickness energy? They're in some kind of, um, they're emotionally unstable right now. They're just in the home, just getting readings done, tarot readings done. Six of Wands reverse. It ain't gonna work. Did not work. They're trying to get you sick. I keep seeing they're trying to get a feminine energy sick. This could be a Virgo. Queen of Pentacles. They're trying to get a woman sick and possibly some kids. And then I'm saying they're trying to get a pregnant woman sick to attract her own death or something like that. Show me this message reverse. See, they're not talking. Because this person feels like they got the power. Your twin flame feels like they got the power because they're about to bounce. This could be a feminine energy getting ready to leave um, for some of you guys. You guys know if it's a feminine or a masculine. What's out is Empress. The lovers. They are trying to um, hermit. They know they're going to be alone after somebody departs or something. They're feeling lonely and stuff. Whoever's in this environment or home, they're spending a lot of time to themselves, loving themselves, nurturing themselves. Three of Pentacles. Hanged in reverse is trying to come out. What are they trying to do with this energy? It's karmic, hanged in reverse, three coins. They're, see, this is what they're trying to do. Moon and Scorpio, they're trying to have power. They're trying, this is basically um, dark magic they're trying to do. Jupiter and Taurus, they found something out, possibly about somebody's um, money, some kind of wealth. They know that you're going to be helping them or something like that. You could be getting ready to help your person or something. They know you guys are going to be in collaboration in the material world. Something about someone's status. The sun.
Ace of Cups. Yeah, they found out about some new love. A new start in love or some kind of reconciliation or reunion. Show me more about this dark magic stuff. Ace of Coins reverse. They're trying to have you guys miss the opportunity or make sure somebody doesn't receive some kind of help. Four cups reversed. They're trying to get your energy off balance and have you unstable. Yeah, they, if you did this, you already got caught again. There's no other way around this. You're getting left. Okay, show me this energy, resourcefulness. This could be a family dynamic. Enlightenment. Okay, this could be a third party or some um, group of people or some friends. This could be a friend doing this. I'm seeing somebody staying with a friend. They're doing some kind of stuff on them. Misfortune. Because they know there's some kind of misfortune or a tower. This is the same energy. They're trying to hold somebody captive. They are trying to figure out how to get unsick and cast that off onto you guys. Okay, pleasure seekers. Somebody's friends are hella mad or something like right now. They're pissed. Full reverse. They don't want them to have some kind of new start or a new beginning. Possibly in love, Knight of Chalices. The stars. This is going to be very... Um, very very beautiful love very beautiful high priestess reverse six of wands reverse whatever that is that they, that they were doing in the dark did not work it failed and the misfortune chariot reverse four swords They're trying to figure out a way to mess with your guys' mental health, too. They want, yeah, Seven of Cups. They're trying to play in your guys' energy. But they're trying to, like I said, they're trying to, like, cloak themselves so you don't realize that's them. They want you to think, like, no, that's you. That's that's your emotions. Something's wrong with you. You're going crazy or something. Mm -mm. That's not you. This could be family members doing this, too, for some of you guys. Some situation is definitely ending. They're trying to challenge or block a King of Wands energy. They're trying to stop somebody from taking some kind of action or being motivated to leave. <laughs> the way that card just bounced. Full reverse. They're very active, very foolish. fourth house again they're thinking like you guys are not going to learn about this you're not going to see this they don't want somebody to move out of a house but you see this sun and pisces vision you see this they're not protected whoever's doing this is not protected somebody sees you if you're doing this mm-hmm Yep, still leaving. Show me this energy. They're trying to have somebody sick or some shit.
judgment, getting exposed. They want you to feel like um, your life is about to end or something. The tower. Mm -mm. No, it's not. There's maybe getting ready to if they keep doing that. Three of Cups. Ten of Cups. This is what's literally making them sick is your guys' happiness. I keep seeing a lot of reconciliations. They could be, um, I definitely keep seeing them trying to get some kids sick or some family dynamics sick. They want you to feel like all hope is lost. They want you to be in despair. They want you to be depressed. No, you're not. That's them. Moon reverse, yeah. Nothing to worry about. It's already being sent back to the sender. What else, spirit? Yeah, something about kids, children, child. Somebody's rejecting them. They're rejecting them right now. Somebody sees the truth very clearly. False, fake friends. Yeah, somebody's friends are doing that. I'm working on becoming independent from this karmic energy. This could be a phone call. They could have been trying to call somebody. They didn't answer. Yeah, you know why? Because this person's intuitive now. They're more intuitive or they're more highly sensitive. Please listen more and trust your system's subtle messages. Your deeper impressions are correct. Do not doubt yourself. Staying away from you is so damn hard. Somebody's turned off. I would be too. That's the fastest way to turn me off. They're trying to figure out what the fuck they're going to do now. Turned off. Somebody's getting ready to relocate. Relocating. They wouldn't stop with the fuck shit. So I let them go. Yeah, if you're doing this, you're getting let go. Y'all just can't stop for some reason. For some reason. I don't know. go over this real quick and then I'm going to close this out show me this false fake friends or friend they're sad I feel teary energy somebody's friend is um, their friend or something like that is pleasure seekers energy or some group of people they're trying to send their heartbreak off onto you guys or something hermit reverse yeah they're trying to find a way to get you out of the picture they want you in real bad health or depressed seven of swords yeah because they're paranoid and panicking your friends should not be doing nothing like that. This could be a um, king of chalices. This could be a man friend or um, a man's friends or a masculine energy's friends. Your friends should not be doing that at all. That's not a friend. They should not be doing that. Knight of chalices reverse. Okay, somebody's relocating. Seven of Wands. You could have told them you're getting ready to relocate or move somewhere or move to a new place or a new job or something. Six of Cups. Yeah, I keep seeing like somebody's getting ready to reconcile. Somebody's friend. They told their friend they're getting ready to move or something. Knight of Chalices reversed. 
two swords. You're trying to keep them at a stalemate or at a crossroads. Okay, show me this energy turned off. I think everything else is pretty simple. I don't need to clarify that. Turned off. Two of Wands. Seven of Wands. This person's protecting themselves. They're still going to move forward or move out or whatever. Six of coins reverse. They're turned off because they're trying to um, they're trying to create an imbalance, and they're trying to hold and cling on to them. This real clingy energy. This person's like holding back from them and stuff, in the in the environment. They could be not talking and holding back communication. Turned off. Nine of Wands reverse. They're getting sick and tired of this. They're seeing this person's a devil energy. Their their mask already came off. King of Swords reverse. Some karmic masculine keeps coming out. They're trying to stop an emperor energy. This could be one of their friends or one of your friends. This could be somebody who's staying with a, a man or some men. This could be a family member. Is this the person that's trying to take somebody out or kill them or something? Yeah, Eight of Wands. Yeah, Ace of Swords. They're trying to send some energy off onto you guys. Don't worry. It's going to be set right back. Eight of Coins. The Divine's already working on it behind the scenes. Don't worry. If this, uh, what else? <laughs> They're going to take care of it. That's all I can say. You guys are protected. Protection. Don't worry. Do what you guys need to do. Pray. Whatever you guys need to do to protect your guys self spiritually. I'll see y'all later.